Russian President Vladimir Putin's biggest critic is dead. The cause of the opposition leader Alexei Navalny's death has not been established yet. But what we do know so far is that the 47-year-old was serving a 19-year sentence in the Arctic penal colony where he died. The prison claims that Alexei Navalny had felt unwell after a walk and had lost consciousness immediately. But was his prison life responsible for his worsening health? Now, Navalny was serving his sentence in the IK3 prison camp in Karp on charges of extremism and fraud. Nicknamed as a polar wolf, this penal colony is located in yamalo Ninets region, well above the Arctic Circle. Temperatures here can go as low as minus 30 degrees Celsius. He was shifted to the prison in early December last year. His days at the facility were testing physically as well as mentally from ill cellmates to solitary confinement to being denied proper medical treatment to being forced to listen to pro-Putin pop songs all the time. An Amnesty International report last year had catalogued Navalny's medical treatment records after being poisoned with nerve agent Novichok and spending about three weeks in coma, Alexei Navalny had become very weak. Prison life only added to his worsening condition. Beginning in December 2022, he was repeatedly being put in a cell with another prisoner who was said to be in very poor health condition. And there were no preventive measures that were put in place to protect Navalny's health. It is during this time that he contracted a respiratory infection. Despite his worsening condition, the prison administration reportedly refused to move either him or the other prisoner to a medical ward. In 2023, over 500 Russian doctors even signed an open letter demanding for Navalny to be seen by a civilian doctor. The prison complex is known for collective punishment. Former prisoners of the colony in Karp have also described instances of torture. One former convict in a 2018 interview said that he was beaten from all sides with a truncheon on arrival. The Russian authorities have in fact denied such allegations, but according to the federal prison system estimates, there have been an annual anywhere from 1,400 to 2,000 prison deaths over the last five years. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.